Hello everyone, Black Ice here, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Last time we left off, we did not have a very great run at all, despite being the golden god of the game. But um, anyway, today we're going to, um, well, I don't want to continue, I was uh, experimenting a little bit. Today I'm actually going to do an Azazel run, or Azazel run, or whatever you want to call him. Um, because I want to unlock something. I want to get the boss rush with Azazel. So, we're going to try to get some of that going and not take early stupid damage. And to do that, we got to go fast. So, we're going to be going fast. Okay, well, that probably wasn't a great pickup. We got our speed down a little bit. Although, we do get invincibility after a little while. Nothing for me in here, really. So basically what I'm going to do is just get the item room and go. Dang it. I hate this guy. He, he can be sort of tricky to fight close range like this. But um, we do get him. Got a kick terror card, high priestess, that's pretty good. And curse the maze or whatever that was just there. Helped me out a little bit. I'm going to put that bomb there for the tinted rock. Get that guy. Pick up our soul hearts. And continue on. Boss is right there. Not bad. Alright, so let's go take on the boss. It's Gemini, so not that bad. Not a very tough boss. Um, I want to see if I can get the little guy first. Because uh, he can be dangerous when the big guy is gone. Oh, here we go. I'm getting fast. Gotta go fast. Alright, so we're just gonna go Sanic on him. We unlocked the cellar. I don't know how we've done that, but uh, Ooh, I didn't mean to take that. Ooh, ooh, that ended up being pretty good, though. So we're going to take that, go down, all stats up, then shuffle. That's not something I normally take, but it worked out this time. I don't know how I unlocked the cellar now, because I've beaten that boss before. Ooh, I don't want to take that. I'm going to find the item room and get out. Oh, come on. Why won't this... Yeah, okay, my charge time's gone up a bit, it seems. But that's probably... Wow, I took damage to a poop. Come on, charge time. Alright, there we go. Well, don't really need the charge time so much anymore. Alright, and now we do. Come on. Um, don't need that. Item is, yeah, sure, piercing shots, because I don't have piercing shots already. Alright, let's get out of here. There's a shop right there. Not really interested in that. Oh, that hurt, though. Alright, um, another bomb. It's going up. Nothing in here for me. I'm really not liking this extra charge time that happened because of the stupid experimental treatment. Uh, we do have another bomb, so uh, I'm going to try to see if I can get a secret room. There we go. Uh, can't open that chest, so I don't have any keys. Uh, don't have any keys from this either, but we do get our bomb back. So it's like it never happened, although I have to really go fast to get out of here. You basically have to beat Mom's foot in 20 minutes to get a uh, boss rush, or less than 20 minutes, I should say. We have Monstro, not that bad. There we go. Because so, we only need like to get a few good shots in on him. Other than that, um, okay, and we're starting to go real fast. Come on, Sanic fast. There we go. We've taken on another boss with our Sanic speed. All right, um, Placenta, I'll take it. See what the devil has to offer. Uh, Sister Maggie, not gonna take it. I'll take the coin though. All right, let's get on out of here. Alright, yep, we're making okay time, I think. Not quite sure, and this is an XL4, so... I don't know if we want to go for the two item rooms. We can, certainly, but... I don't know if that's going to be a great idea, just because of the time it takes. Oh, come on. Alright, well, I'll get this then. That works. What do we have here? Two diamonds, uh, sure. Use that now. Because I want to keep the High Priestess card. It's a really good card. Um can't get anything from there. Actually, I can't even get any of the item rooms unless I pick up a key along the way. I'm not going to take that. Let's just go this way more. Alright, uh, everything is being taken out pretty easily. Come on, guy. Alright, dead. Got a key, so one of the item rooms we will be taking at least. Alright, and let's just circle. Get another key. Alright, so we want to get both the item rooms if possible. I know that's not always easy. Come on. Alright, let's fly on over here, take him out. And nothing really special there. Oh gosh, uh, 
don't really like these guys too much. They run away from you too, so they can be sort of tricky to fight because of the way they spawn the enemies like that. But um, we take care of them pretty easily here. Really no point to this room, so I'm going to just try to beat it as fast as I can. And they can't really get me out here. I'm probably just going to end up waiting until the Sanic speed kicks in. Not intentionally, but yeah, here we go. It is an easy way to clear the room, though. So if you got patience or time or both, then you're in luck with that sort of uh, sort of item there. It's really not bad. I just don't like the initial speed down it gives you, but um, it's overcome because you just start building up speed in the room, and if you don't kill everything super fast. Then, well, you will start to kill everything super fast. Okay, got the Q bones here. Wow, already took two damage to them. All right, um, dang it. I was hoping to find some kind of item room. Wow, it took damage to that stupid guy. Should not have done that. Alright, last one. Got another key, good. Um, I guess we go up. Why not? Okay, no. I mean, the chest is good, yes, but I want the item rooms and I want them bad. I also want the boss room, but yeah, this floor has taken quite a while. That was just a bad play on my part. Um, don't have to worry about the spikes here. Nothing really in here. And I know I can bomb out of the rooms, but I want to save the, the bombs for tinted rocks if at all possible. Oh, great. Uh, this is not a room I'm looking forward to. This, these guys are always hard to take out with Azazel. I'm just gonna... Uh -huh. uh, see, that's exactly why. Because you have to get close, and that stuff's hard to dodge from close up. So, I'm gonna get, a, get on out of here. It's, take out the poops one by one. Oh, come on, really? I didn't get the poop, and I unleashed a fly. Alright, got you, and got you. I uh, don't need that. Here's our item rooms. I think the boss room's probably gonna be around here somewhere. Alright, come on. Again, I'm probably just gonna end up waiting for the um, Sanic Speed to kick in. Yeah. Again, not intentionally, but it just the way it works out. Alright, let's take our item rooms. We have the dead bird, which is pretty good. Alright, and what else we got? Uh, Mom's draw, which is pretty shitty. Okay, wow, I actually said that on camera, <laughs> okay. Um, welcome to Black Ice Uncensored. Yeah, usually I don't swear on camera that much, but I don't know. I just really hate this item because it's really bad. That's all it does. Yay, everything's frozen. Yay, and he doesn't like, take... Oh, wow. He just suddenly took all the damage there. And we got two bosses to take care of on this floor, because it is an XL. And we are going to, uh... And I guess we get our charge back, right? Alright, we got the matchbook, evil up, and a couple of bombs. I'll take it. Alright, and we go on here, mega fatty. Um, again, this is basically just buying time for us to get our, um... Super speed up. Oh, wow, did not expect that at all, actually. I really didn't. I got pulled in really fast there. Alright, and let's just Sanic Speed. That might not be able to take him out, actually. No, it didn't, but this will. GG Mega Fatty, take that. Let's go on in here, got our Soul Hearts, thank you Angel. Leave now, not gonna blow you up. Alright, so 10 minutes in, and we are on the first Necropolis 4. I'd say we're doing, or deaths actually. Glad it's not Necropolis. Oh gosh, yep. The initial speed down from the Taurus really, really messed me up there. Uh, normally I would have been able to dodge that, although it was not a smart idea to move. It's just normally I could get away with that mistake because of Azazel's base speed. Oh wow. Oh wow, did not expect that. Alright, um, now we just have one more. Ah, I hate those guys so much. Anything I have to fight close range that is pretty good at countering close range. I don't like it, obviously. Alright, come on, let's, uh... Okay, good, we took out the jumping guy. He's the main problem, and ooh, he's gonna explode if I take him out, so I don't want to get too close. There we go. Uh, the callus, not really useful, because that flight. I like callus because it's basically flight without flight. If that makes any sense. And I'm just gonna take a ton of damage here, aren't I? Alright, and we get... Actually, the Callus, I think, might protect me from 
I mean, it's better than nothing, first of all. It might protect me from this on the way out, too. I don't know. Will it? No, it doesn't. Okay, well, good, good experiments, I suppose. Now, the only problem I have with this boss rush we're gonna go into here, potentially, I don't feel overpowered enough to actually be able to take out all the bosses. I don't have a lot of health. I don't really have a whole lot going for me, so it's a little bit nervous about it. But we'll see. Oh, there we go. Well, there's at least part of our answer. All right, check out our damage now, and then when we pick it up, yeah, maxed. Haha. -ha. Get a little bit of a speed upgrade too, and I guess the. Uh, oh gosh, no, no. Nope. Nope. There we go. He's dead. That was pretty scary. Alright, and we have the mom hands. I'm actually... I mean, we've saved enough time where I think that, uh... We can probably go shopping. See what our Steam sale... Um... Not really worth it since I could only buy the Steam sale here. So I'm just gonna take our soul heart. This fire. And, uh... Donate the rest, I guess. Because I don't... I'm probably not going to go shopping too much, if at all. And I do want to get that 999. We are getting really close to that. So we can get the stopwatch. Alright. Let's go on up here. And these guys aren't too much of a problem. Just got to charge up. And that takes a while sometimes. Alright, well, here we go. Now they're really not much of a problem. We get a card. We get the Joker. Yeah, I'm going to take that for sure. We get uh, another three soul hearts. Thank you. Thank you, Angel. You were very kind and nice. And our boss room is over here. I'm um, just gonna throw that down there because there's a tin rock. We get the kill. A couple of extra bombs. And uh, take out that guy. Alright, so we get the Fallen. I'm gonna use this because I don't like the Fallen. So we're just gonna... Wow, I killed him before he... Oh, I guess that doesn't really work now, does it? Alright, does this work though? Not really. Alright, that does though. And so does that. Haha, <laughs> suck it. I got the mark. We got a bit of a attack up and a soul heart out of the deal. Alright, I'm feeling a little bit better about the boss rush, but we have to make it there first. Especially in the Necropolis 2, that could be a bit of an issue. I want to just try to get all that I can from these fires, if I can get anything from them at all. Alright, and we got nothing. Whatever. That's fine, I suppose. And we have Teratoma here. Teratoma is a really annoying boss because of all the spiders. Um, but so far, so good. Alright, um, take out our last spider there. Took some damage I shouldn't have. Open the item room, we get Leo Stompy. That's pretty good. Uh, so now if you see any tinder rocks, we don't need bombs for it. So what I'm going to do is blow up this uh, boarded up door. Because there could be a black market in here. And probably not, but uh, let's see what's in here. This probably just goes to the next floor. Yeah, I don't want that. I will, however, sleep in the bed. Alright, I guess I can't because I don't have any red hearts missing. But uh, yeah, not a very good choice to make there. Another Teratoma boss, really. Oh, wow. Okay, um, shouldn't be too bad then. I like how I can just like run into anything and break it. That makes me feel more overpowered than I actually am. Let's see, what do we got? A key and a coin. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. And I'm sort of... I sort of overcame that uh, initial speed down of the Taurus through the... I guess the experimental treatment a tiny bit. and But more so than that, the uh, magic mushroom. Alright, let's uh, open up this door, see what we got. Reroll our build. No thanks. I like what we have. I'm pretty confident in this now. Alright, there's another shop, but no point really going there. Alright, and I swear, this thing's happening faster now. I think that's because my speed has gone up, and since it takes my speed less time to reach max now, that it actually, uh, oh, that was dumb damage by me. Come on, I really need some kind of soul hearts or something here. I don't get anything. Alright, um, let's just go in here. Here. Uh, can't really use that much. 
And yeah, I figured they'd be bomb flies. But you know what? That's... Wow, okay. That was a little scary there. Oh, I didn't mean to... Oh, whatever. I guess we can gamble a bit. Let's see, do we get anything? Nope. Blow it up. Uh, how's our time looking? 13 minutes. Not bad. Haha, -ha, you stupid jumping guys. I have outsmarted you. Alright, these guys, though... Uh, I don't like these guys. Okay. What I'm gonna do now is... Alright, wait for this to wear off. Oh, oh, we got more cards. What, what is this? The moon. Okay, no thanks. I'm gonna do the chariot card on Ma. Oh, then I can't use the high priestess card. Alright, I'll, I'll take the high priestess card then. Chariot's okay, but I was planning on using it on Mom to uh, just buy me some time. Uh, you know, until this happens, because then I could use Chariot, and then my speed would be up already. Alright, didn't really expect that to work out too well, and it didn't. But, um, you know, easy mom fight there. We unlocked the boss rush for sure. Um, oh, you know how I could have, well, no, not really, because then I'd have to take the moon card. Alright, so I'm going to take the, the Polaroid, because the chest is cool. We're going to go into the boss rush room. Let's see. Ooh, there's Ipecac. I'm gonna take it. I don't know what happens with, uh... Okay, nothing happens. But hopefully I get the damage up anyway. And, uh, I am actually gonna... Oh, kill that fly. Wait for this guy to... die. Alright, and... Here's where I'm gonna use... Yeah, because of... This guy right here. There we go. Because that way... One of the biggest problems with Boss Rush is that guy leaving the red poop everywhere, and now he can't do that. Also, I got the dead bird working for me, so I'm gonna use the High Priestess card here. Oh, that oh that did not do what I thought it would. For whatever, I thought that was the Empress card I had, but um, I guess that's okay. I would have saved that for something better if I if I remembered correctly what that did. Oh, we got Soul Heart. Just gonna dodge people a little bit. Go around here. Alright, um, I'm not feeling quite as powerful as I should, I guess, and I'm kind of, oh, wow, stupid friggin' spiders, man. I forgot what that came from. It's not this guy, though. Okay, we got Loki. Let's wait for him to do his thing. Oh, come on. I'm taking so much stupid damage. So much damage I should not be taking. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. No, no, no. No, stop doing that stupid jump thing, you jerk. Alright, these guys are a little bit easier to deal with, but... Alright, where's Loki? He's all the way up here. Right, get back here, Loki. Haha, you're dead. Oh, and he drops a soul heart, too. We got the Steven boss, we got the Gemini boss. And I got the running into the boss damage. So, um, these guys are pretty easy. Oh, the, I mean, seriously, it spawned on top of my head. What am I supposed to do about that? Yeah, things like that happen in this game a lot. But um, the best thing you can do is just, you know, laugh at it or something. I don't know. I'm not really laughing right now. But just don't let it affect you too much because confidence is a huge thing in this game. And if you're not confident, you're not going to win. Oh, gosh. But uh, luckily, with the build I have, I have a lot of confidence in it because of the Ipecac giving me an amazing damage up. Or at least it seems like it does, and I'm just going to believe it does, because that will make me confident. We got the Chad boss here. And Chad is almost done. Chad is done. Dead Bird helping out pretty much. Pretty good. Dead Bird's nice. I like it. There's a Soul Heart up here. Don't know how long that has been there. Alright. Let's take out Gertie. Gertie's not too much of a challenge. We got Chubb. Oh wow, I'm actually slower than Chubb. I wonder why my uh, Taurus thing hasn't taken effect yet. I mean, I thought that was just something that would keep going off and would actually be a saving grace here. But uh, no, not at all. I don't. I mean, it may have gone off once at the beginning and I just forgot. Monstro 2 is down. Got Gish here. Gish kind of has a lot of health, too. What? Oh, he spawned those guys. Oh, oh, I did not see that. 
his stupid black shot blended in with the black creep over there. Alright, he's almost dead though. There we go, Gish down. We do have a lot of red hearts here, so I can afford to take some damage. I don't want to, obviously, but um, if I need to, the option is there. Well, I mean, I guess taking damage is never really something you choose to do. Alright, there we go. Got Soul Heart. We got the Hollow. We got the, the Husk. The Husk is not that bad. Yeah, he's dead already. And these guys are pretty easy as well. Alright, um, let's see. We have... Oh, the Bloat. Taking him out first. Oh, he did end up killing the Heart, I think. The Heart of the Mask. Come on. Yes, Bloat is dead. Yeah, he did kill the Heart of the Mask with his Brimstone shot. So, uh, thank you for that, Bloat. But, um, you are dead now. And we have Swollen Horseman down. And can we take out Famine? We can. We sure can. We got War. And I think that's Death over there. Oh, come on. Oh, my charge. I'm still not used to this charge time. Yeah, um, I just got a Horseman Sandwich right there. Alright, and we have Death still running around. I just don't want to spawn more of those zombies. And we have, um, a horse, and then... Really? That sucks. Get back here. We got the Fallen boss. I want to take out the Fallen guy really quick, though. He is the most problematic of these two bosses, for sure. Alright, he is taken out rather easily. We have the Headless Horseman, who is a relatively easy boss. Although, I don't want to speak too soon. The Nail has appeared in the basement. That is not what I thought I'd unlock. Um, great. Well, and we have the guillotine, which I'm not even going to take, because that's a pretty bad item. Alright, well, we got the nail. I wanted to unlock the abaddon, but I guess I have to either beat the chest or in the dark room. Anyway, moving on. That was a lot of bosses to be killed, by the way. Wow. Um, so far so good, though. Oh, oh, no, I wanted that bomb, actually. Thank you, game. So, hopefully... Oh, uh, I gotta be careful about... Um, I forgot I can break rocks here, and I know some of the rocks, if you break them here, they hurt you. Um, got some hearts there if we need. Uh, whoa, that guy's fast. And let's just take these guys out. Yeah, that, that scared me, actually, a little bit there. Alright, they're dead. We got the... Does this actually do anything? Not really. Um, I'll take the... They both do nothing, so... I mean, I don't know. Hard to make the decision there of what to take. Alright, and this guy's dead. We don't really need a rush anymore, so that's good. I can take my time now. And I think that will prove to be invaluable, because time is good. Alright, um, and we have our boss room right here, so I guess we'll just fight the boss. Oh, we have Skrillex. Oh, I messed up there. Oh no, I can still do damage to him here, apparently. Because you can only damage him on the on his tail like that. See that spot that shows up? Oh, I... Oh, he's so close. Haha, -ha, he's dead. Alright, we have an Eternal Heart. I'll, I'll take this just for the HP up. I don't think the shot speed down affects it, so... I'm gonna go out, grab this, take our Eternal Heart, and we'll be on our way. So we basically got a double HP up from that boss, so that's pretty good. Especially... Especially now that we don't have any Soul Hearts or Black Hearts or anything, so... You know, we gotta have something, right? Um, although I'm pretty sure that guy should have died, he just didn't. Uh, we, what do we get in the red chest? A teleport to the devil room. It'll bring us down. I don't want to go there. Um, because that will, um... I want... I took the Polaroid. If I took the negative, I would have gone down, because that's just a free skip of the boss here, which is pretty nice. We got Envy. I don't know why Envy is so envious. 
take them all out. If we can, and we can't. Almost, though. And so far, those rocks haven't killed me yet, so... Happy about that. And one more left. It's dead. I'm not gonna take the pill. Oh gosh. Uh, I'm gonna take this guy out before his weird damage ends up killing me. Alright, and let's just go this way. If only we had like the curved horn or something. That would be oh wow. That was that was really bad. It would have been okay if I aimed the right direction, and I did not aim the right direction. Wow, I can't even get this guy. Alright, thank you, Dead Bird. You helped me out there. And we have these guys. Not too bad, except he kind of shoots out like, oh, well, he's dead now, so I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm just gonna do this while I'm invincible. Hopes to get some hearts, but uh, did not work out that way. And take you out. Um, let's see, I think the boss will probably be this way. Yeah. Alright, um, I do have to be careful though, because these poops can sneak up on you when they're such close quarters like this. And we're just gonna get rid of everything here. I guess I should take the Petride Poop, it's literally better than what I have now. I'm just hoping to get a Soul Heart in one of those remaining piles of poop. Or right there, that would work too for getting a Soul Heart. Um, thanks game. Alright, I'm gonna charge up, use the item, freeze everything, get in a couple of- oh, that doesn't freeze these guys, apparently. That kinda sucks. Let's take them out with the invincibility, then. Alright, I was hoping to get a few free shots in on the mom thingy. It lives, or whatever they call it these days. That's our soul heart gone. Um, I hate having to navigate across this just to kill the stupid enemies it spawns. Alright, and that's it, dead. Cool. Uh, let's go up to the cathedral. Which, um, hopefully will be easy. You know what? I think I have new respect for this item because it has helped me out quite a bit. I, I pretty much just called it out right at the beginning and oh, I hate these enemies so much. And it has helped me out a heck of a lot more than I thought it would. So, glad about that. Oh, come on, the jumping guys. Alright, well, he can't jump anymore, and the rest of them go away. Could really use some hearts or something, you know? Uh, that works. Thanks, game. Um, would you mind stirring a bit more? Uh, that would be super fantastic and great. Alright, well, I can take these guys out. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? Two spades that'll multiply my keys. Yeah, I'll take that for sure. Especially with the chest coming up in the distance. Uh, assuming we can get there. Wow. That boss died pretty fast. I mean, it has a low HP pool, but it's always fun to do that. Alright, what do we got? A bomb and a key. Not bad. Not bad. I'll take it. Alright, let's go to the... the right, I guess. And we have double... Gertie Jr. I really hate this boss. I can't explain how much I hate this boss because there's no... Oh wow, it almost defeated me. Uh, I have to use my item and I get in trouble. Well, I'm gonna do it now actually because these guys are psychic and I don't want their shots to... Oh, there we go. Thank you, game. You are so nice and kind. I will love and respect you for... Oh gosh! Except for these guys. Oh man, I hate these guys so much. See, they don't even die when you hit them with the invincibility thing. It's so unfair. Oh, okay, we got the pinky eye. I guess it's better than the poop thing for now. And we have this boss. A little bit scary, but not, not now because I have my Sanic speed. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, thank you. Judgment. Help me out, buddy. Help me out, man. I got some money for you. I got regen and I got some luck up. Uh, thanks, I guess. So I forgot the placenta gives you regen. I still have that, so that's going to hopefully be pretty big for this run here. 
Alright, and that boss is down. We have Judas's tongue. That makes devil deals cost less. Does this pinky eye thing actually affect me? I'm gonna wait until I get any kind of green sort of shot here. It might not actually show up. You know what? I can already poison them because I have Ipecac, so I'm gonna take Judas's tongue. And we have another judgment. Hey, buddy. Uh, I'm gonna give you some money and you're gonna help me out, aren't ya? Ooh, thank you. Thank you very much for the secret map. Um, that reveals the secret room, so that'll help quite a, quite a lot. Now we have more money for the next one we, we run into. I am gonna go to the other secret room as well. The super secret room. It's all the way down here. Alright. In both of the judgment rooms, too. Pretty cool. Um, let's see, what do we get in the red chest? Couple of soul hearts, thank you game. And thank you Judgment for giving me the blue map that shows me all of the secret rooms. At least I think that's what it does. I'm pretty sure that's what it does. Yeah, because the rest of the map hasn't been revealed or anything. Um, nothing in here. Guessing it would be this way. If any way at all. Haha. -ha. Alright, yeah, those guys are usually pretty easy. Oh, that is so unfair. Did not see that coming at all. And how could you blame me? That, like, that just happened out of nowhere. Well, we lost one of our soul hearts, unfortunately. Oh, re really? This is a very terrible, terrible room. But I can luckily take them out now. Let's use the bombs on the fires. Hopefully get some soul hearts. There we go. That's one, two, thank you game. Thank you, game. Alright, and we have these psychic guys to deal with. Although they're not that bad. That's mainly the mom hands we gotta watch out for now. Which aren't that bad because I have this. And what do we have here? Vision. That'll be helpful for the next floor. Alright, so we're gonna go in here, use this, and get some good damage in while we can. Oh, and that, that too. Come on, dead bird, you got it. You got this, dead bird. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna... It's gonna be hard to get good damage in on this guy. Ah, dang it. He's gonna have to circle and stuff and try to evade as best as I can. Alright, becomes a little easier, but still not very easy because of having to get so close. Oh, gosh. Dang it. Dang it. Alright, we got the the regen coming up pretty big. Alright, uh, get in the corner. Get in the corner. Alright, play it safe. Play it patiently. Run when you need to. And we got it. We did it. We're going to the chest. Okay, that was close. That was scary. That was close, but we're doing good. Alright. So hopefully we get a good four items here. I'm gonna pop the vision thingy. We got bum friend. We got the three dollar bill. We got the fire tears. We got the toxic tears. I guess I'll take it all. I really don't have much of a choice now, do I? None of these things are actually gonna, you know, be harmful to me. Well, in theory, anyway. <laughs> oh, cool. Um, I have some kind of spectral tier thing going on here right now. We got a triple Loki fight, which uh, is going to keep using our Sanic speed to our advantage. And it looks almost like my... Uh... Alright, there we go. Regen coming up pretty big again. I have one Loki down, two Loki down, bomb fly down, and three Loki down. Haha. We got a troll bomb, though. Not too... Oh, gosh. Um... You gotta be really careful about these guys. Alright, that's one down. Oh no, he's, now it's one down. Oh come on, I thought I had that charged up. Oh, and I thought I wouldn't take damage there. Alright, hopefully this, uh, here we go. Let's go on in here, hopefully the secret room has something nice for us. If it's money, then, oh, it's greed. So hopefully he drops a lot of money so bum friend can pick it up and uh, he dropped the steep sale. The most useless thing you could have dropped because there's no more shops left. Alright, um, I'm gonna make my way to the the other um 
Oh, wow. The other, what's it called? Secret room? Yeah, that's what it's called. I'm actually going to use this to take out the little ones, because I can just take out the big ones really fast. Uh, they turned into little ones, but, you know, they're not that bad now. Alright, and we got a bomb. I guess it's not bad. Double cage fight. Okay. Oh, you know why I had the spectral thing? It was the $3 bill. Oh, why isn't... Why wasn't this one frozen? Huh. Interesting. And the $3 bill has given me the number one effect right now. Alright, one cage down. Uh, come on, I can take the other cage. Oh, dang it, he fell on my head. Not fair, man, not fair. Alright, and avoid the spikies. And other cage down. We got a pill. I don't know, man. I don't know. Got a big room. The regen. We gotta take out all the, the husks and the dukes of flies. Alright, there we go. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? My invincibility ran out mid shot. That is not fair. I was so close to the other secret room and the boss. No. Alright, well. At least this was an interesting run, at the very least. <sighs> wow, okay, that was pretty intense too. That uh, So many unfair things happened though, but you know what? I had a lot of fun, it was a great run. I, It was close at the end, it was. Um, I seriously thought that I would make it farther than I did though. But uh, we beat the boss rush, we unlocked the nail, wanted to unlock the Abaddon, but uh, ultimately failed in doing so. I might not have even chosen the right path for that, but um, anyway, that's going to do it for me for today, so thank you all so much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye everyone. Have a great day.